Right, in this video I'm going to show you how to remove a Ford Fusion 3 rear light. I've already done the passenger side, now I'm going to show you how to do the driver's side. It's exactly the same way. For this, what you need is a Phillips screwdriver and a flathead screwdriver or some form of a pry bar. And I'll show you exactly how you do it. So you've got two Phillips screws, one there and one here holding it on the outside and then in here on this piece of trim you just want to undo that Phillips as well so then this plastic trim can come away and I'll show you how that looks so now that I've removed the screws not so easy to do one-handed so I have to pause the video and that one's undone as well you've still got a wing nut inside that needs removing I'm going to try and do this one-handed Essentially, you want to pry this forwards. There's a couple of clips behind it that need to come loose. If that pops off, it's not a problem. You can always put it straight back on as long as you kept the screw. And then just in here, you've got, let me see if I can get that to focus. You've got a wing nut just underneath the wire in there. Just so what you want to do is undo your wing nut it's quite a long thread on this your wing nut. I'll also undo the wires while you're at it. Just a simple push and release. At this point the light should be loose. The only thing that may be stopping it is there is a small locator pin up here without damaging the light. Hopefully that shows it. Just want to gently loosen it. Pause this, I've got both hands for a moment. Alright, so once you've managed to just loosen it enough, that should come loose, and then the whole unit will come out. That's how it looks there. Just a bit of dirt and crud in there, that's caused it to get a little bit stiff. And that's your unit. Hopefully, that helps, and if it does, please give this video a thumbs up. Cheers.